We have the belief that Kogi will be changed. Kogi will be transformed. Amen. Kogi will be lifted. Amen. As Christ had the strength and faced the cross, God will give the leadership of Kogi State, particularly the governor, the strength to face the challenges and overcome in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. The Deputy Governor, Simon Achuba, used Mount Tabor, the symbolic mount of transfiguration, to inform the pilgrims on the need for spiritual fortification. Try to follow the line of prayer. Before you know it, you will start praying very well. You don't need to be uh, a prayer warrior for God to hear you. It's just a matter of saying what is in your mind and what you desire in your heart, and God will hear you. I be transformed in his likeness and after his image. And this is the reason why we are children of God, that we will be properly transformed. Jesus came here, they were transformed. He, uh, he, the, the disciples around him enjoyed the same thing. And I'm here as a child of God to enjoy transformation in God. He also advised Christians to be focused on God's purpose for them. We have come for a spiritual revival. And I pray that all of us will be taught and be revived. Yeah. Yeah. The Kogi pilgrims used the opportunity to express their gratitude to the state government for enabling them to be part of this year's spiritual exercise. And I want to use this opportunity to appreciate the uh, government of Kogi State for making it possible for us to be here. It's an experience, it's a worldwide experience, experience that every one of us should have. I came, it's been prayers, we've been praying for my children, I'm praying for my state and for my Kogi State, and I pray that. Uh, our prayers here will be heard. I have to thank His Excellency. That's a Yahya, Dr. Ben. I know so you mean uh, the, the mean uh, uh, tribal, the uh, tribal uh, Uricha, the concept of uh, government. You know, because of them, I won't be in my life. Mount Tabo in Jerusalem is the place many Christians call the home of spiritual rebirth, as this was where Jesus Christ prayed to renew his strength to face the purpose of his spiritual calling. Avoy Unwogu. AIT News, Jerusalem.